experimental side effects are some movement disorder side effects that the antipsychotics can cause. They're mainly associated with the older typical antipsychotics, which have a main method of action as dopamine receptor antagonists. Their aim target for the antipsychotic activity is in the mesolimbic pathway. But the experimental side effects come from their antidopaminergic activity in the negrostriatal pathway. We can group the side effects in when they will occur after starting the antipsychotic in a patient. For example, if a patient has been on the antipsychotic for days to weeks, they could present with akathisia and inner feeling of restlessness, or they could also present with an acute dystonia, sustained contraction of a muscle typically affecting the eye muscles, jaw muscles, or neck muscles. Weeks and months after starting the antipsychotic, the patient may develop Parkinsonism with a triad of rigidity, bradykinesia, and a resting tremor. And after several years of being on a high dose of a typical antipsychotic, the patient may develop the severe side effects of tardive dyskinesia, a very distinctive, permanent and repetitive movements of the facial muscles. The reversal agent of antipsychotic extrapyramidal side effects is procyclidine, an anticholinergic drug.